I was thinking this morning and I was saying that it would be very good for us as Christians to be able, even as we pray, to follow everything that the government is doing. You know, we have the 100 days and then of course we have the other days that are coming. But you know, within these 100 days, you know, that the president uh, and the deputy president gave promises to Kenya, one of the big things that is being done today is launching the Hustler Fund. And this fund is going to help us do business. I'm a believer of having a church that does business and a church that has money. Christians that are rich. Amen? We just returned from South Korea and uh, we attended one of the biggest churches in South Korea that has 100,000 members. The choir alone is about 1,200 at Bishop Mulandi. As in all this would be the choir. And I pray that God will give you that in your generation. That you will see a choir that is more than a thousand. And you know it was interesting that 90% of the people in that church are business people. And not just small business, not just mediocre business, but they are millionaires and billionaires. How I pray that in this generation... Bishop Gitonga, Bishop Makarioki, that we can have people in the church that call the shots when it comes to the business. Because, uh, you know, the Bible says that the wisdom of a poor man is despised, isn't it? So that means the wisdom of a rich man is accepted, isn't it? So that is my prayer today that we shall take advantage of everything that our government is doing, that we shall take ad advantage of the Hustler Fund that is being launched today so that we can increase our businesses. And